The master plan for Frankfurt Airport has two main components. One is for the expansion of the airport. That means that's the standard aviation business, new runway, apron and terminal areas. And the second, which is as important as aviation, is the so-called non-aviation business. So how to develop the retail areas and the property areas. This project, this master plan in total is the biggest private investment of its kind in Germany. When you sum up all these investment plans, then you end up at an, a figure of around 9 billion euros, which are 4 billion for the expansion of the aviation business, runway, terminal and so on. 3 billion is the modernization of the existing facilities. And then the, the property developments are also another 2 billion. Out of these 9 billion, I would say short term are 3 to 4 billion investments that are already decided and will happen. So it's nothing like all these funny sketches that you see here in Cannes of city developments that will never happen. This is something that is real and coming. We also look for partners in this development. We currently have a very conservative approach that we want to fund everything on our own, which is directly at the airport. There's this, it's this famous expression of airport fence. Whatever is inside the airport fence is done by Fraport. But around the airport, we also have areas that are open for developers and investors because we have acquired some areas by other companies um, in a total of, I would say, 180 hectares that are now also open for joint developments. And the most famous project in this kind is this, the so-called Air Rail Center, which is in construction now, which is a partnership between IVG and Fraport.